मल्स नॉट ऑल डिजर्ट आर इंडलेस सी और रोलिंग सैंड्यूल इट मीन दैट द ऑल डिजर्ट ऑन द अर्थ है नॉट द इंडलेस डिजर्ट और सैंड्यूल सम आर रॉकी पैडी एंड डॉटेड सम स्मॉल ब्रशेस वाइल अदर आर स्प्राइड विथ द कलरफुल फ्लावर्स ड्यूरिंग द स्प्रिंग इट मीन्स दैट सम डिजर्ट हैव द रॉकी पेवर्स रॉक एंड फ्लावर ड्यूरिंग द स्प्रिंग गुड मॉर्निंग मैम टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन पैराग्राफ टू ऑफ द चैप्टर डेजर्ट एनिमल फ्रॉम माई हनी शक्कर बुक ऑफ स्कूल देर आर मैनी टाइप्स ऑफ स्नेक्स एंड दे कैन काउंटेड अप टू टू थाउजेंड थ्री हंड्रेड ऑफ डिफरेंट काइंड इट मीन्स ऑन आवर अर्थ दे आर सो मैनी टाइप्स ऑफ स्नेक्स दे आर काउंटेड अप टू टू थाउजेंड थ्री हंड्रेड वेराइटीज दे आर क्लासीफाइड बाई अकॉर्डिंग टू दे आर रेंजिंग और हाइट इट मीन्स दे आर अरेंज और ग्रुप्ड बाई देअर हाइट दे आर ऑफ फिफ्टीन सेंटीमीटर स्मॉल ऑल्सो एंड अप टू अलेवन मीटर ऑल्सो लॉन्ग दे आर मैनी स्नेक्स विच आर नॉट हार्मफुल मीन दे आर पॉइजनलेस वेनमलेस बट देर आर मच स्नेक विच कैन किल अस एट वन बाइट ऑल्सो इट मीन्स मैनी ऑफ स्नेक्स आर हार्मलेस और हार्म और वेनमलेस and many of the snakes that can kill us at one bite also uh, snakes also reproduce their young ones by two ways giving egg and re- a bur- uh, giving birth to their babies a snake named rattle snake lives in america is a re- uh, very bad looking reputation means it is looking very bad it can merge with his uh, background also like if it is present at the rocky area or at the mountains steps we cannot see it and if we will put uh, our leg on its any body part then it can bite us it is very bad looking snake but it is very uh, helpful because when we will enter on it, his area at first he will make sound of rattling and that sound is uh, this much uh, loud that we can hear it from 30 meter long also it gives us uh, ma'am warning that they uh, don't enter in my area otherwise he will kill me or any animal and uh, ma'am when uh, we will not uh, uh, follow the uh, instruction of that snake that snake will bite us and uh, we cannot save from its bite also because ma'am it strikes with a lightning speed also ma'am it strike like a light speed we cannot see that when he has striked and we will be dead so ma'am this was my paragraph thank you ma'am have a pleasant day to everybody it's aryan who is going to explain you a paragraph of chapter desert the paragraph goes like this but the rattle snake or rattle as it is sometimes called prefer to avoid people if it possibly can it is said to be just be far from a rattle snake or a rattle because it is very dangerous for us it hold its tail upright and rattles the end whenever it is disturbed in the hope that the intruder will go away the rattle snake just moved its uh, tail and just make a noise which the people think that the rattle snake is here and they go away from here
This is done by rattle for the hope that the person will go away. However, if its warning are ignored and it feel tempted, it will quite re ready to bite. Means if the rattlesnake will think the the person is coming near and he seems means the snake seems that he is in danger, he can he will be quite ready to bite the person. But the rattler itself cannot hear the noise, its own tail make. The rattler is unable to hear the sound which is made by his tail. Its tail. Like most snakes, it hears things through vibration in the ground. Means most of the snake in the world hear most of the vibration through its body which was laid on the ground. The vibration on the ground. If a person walks near by the snake can feel the movement. Means if the person who is just walking or roaming near the snake, the snake will feel that someone is near and how far and how fast he is coming. But if the same person were to shout, it would not hear a thing. Means if the person will make any sound, the snake will not able to hear anything because they have no any uh, capability to hear something. Rattlesnake are very common and widespread animal living right across to the American continent from Canada to Argentina. Means the rattlesnake are mostly found in the continent of America, most in Canada and Argentina. They fed on a variety of prey including mice, wolves, rats, chipmunks and many other animals. This means most of the uh, most of the rattlesnake just survive through their prey. They kill some of they kill their prey like wolves, chipmunks and eat them. Rattlesnake kill their prey with venom. Means rattlesnake kill they are prey with venom. Ven is a venus venom is a type of poison. Like all, ri like all snakes, they swallow the unfortunate animals whole. So, rattlesnake, like all, most of the categories of rattlesnake, eat the whole uh, body and swallow it. Few snakes have to eat more than once a week and some such as a snake like python can survive for a year or more without eating anything. This, this wants to tell that the python or the large skin can swallow a prey and they don't have to eat for a week and a very huge python can survive without eating for a year also means they can survive they have a power to survive for a year without eating a thing if they have if they have catch a prey that is that can survive them hey friends how are you hope so you all are fine and today i am going to explain para four of uh, our chapter 9 digits animal so let's get started para four start like this that mongooses like to hunt together but they always keep a lookout for dangerous predators nearby means uh, mongooses like to hunt together uh, means they are always in group uh, they don't leave their group and when they are hunting for animals means small small animals then they are also aware of uh, uh, other predators that can kill them uh, so th that's why they are always in group uh, poking their noses into holes overturning rocks with their paws and scratching the ground with their sharp claws blinding mongoos are very amusing animals to watch means uh, the uh, mongooses poke their nose into the holes means uh, 
they poke their nose into the holes for search of a small small creatures for eat uh, like there is some gap between the two rock so they uh, poke their nose in the uh, hole between them and uh, they then eat the um, small small creatures that are inside them and um, they overtuning rocks with their paws means they overtune the rocks with their paws like uh, uh, with their paws they side all the rocks th that they can eat simply the uh, small small creatures and and uh, scratching the ground with their sharp claws and they scratch the ground with sharp claws for uh, like uh, uh, for killing some animals like this uh, or the, uh, it is their activity and uh, um, uh, uh, mongooses are very uh, banded um, um, mongoose are very amusing animals to watch means they do so much great activities that if you watch them you will watch them for a long time because they do such a kind of activity that they are, uh, it is so cool so uh, the next line is a common sight in many parts uh, of Africa. They travel in groups of about 20 to forage for beetles, millipeds and other small creatures. Means a, a common sight in many parts of Africa. The means most uh, mongo means most of the species of mongooses are living in Africa and they travel in group of 20, 20 or 20 to 22 like this only to search of forest. Forest is a kind of hunting uh, or for beetles means beetles you know that they are of um, kind of bugs uh, beetles uh, that they can fly also not so high medium heights uh, and millipeds are also millipeds are also small small creatures that uh, mongooses eat them and the uh, other small creatures means other small small creatures. Thank you. Have a nice day. Some sink as the fat is used up means for several days like 5, 10, 15 uh, and they have no food to eat then they use this fat and uh, means uh, their humps uh, shrink because if you use some like water quantity uh, so it will uh, shrink means it will um, become less as you uh, use every time so that's why uh, that is only given that their humps shrink with the every use uh, of the camel then there are many other ways in which camel are adapted to desert life means there are so many ways many ways that uh, camels are uh, adapted to the deserts for surviving uh, one is that their mouth has so tough that even the sharp thorn cannot pierce through means uh, their uh, mouths are so tough means it is so tough that uh, even the sharp thorn means uh, like cactus thorns and in desert uh, all all not matlab, most of the plants uh, are adapted to uh, means uh, that uh, sharp thorns so uh, when they go through that uh, if by mistakenly only then uh, it cannot pierce, uh, pierce their uh, mouth means uh, it cannot cut it or go from here and uh, come from here means metal R par nahi ho sakta hai. so that is only given thorn cannot pierce through so that's all for today thank you and have a nice day everyone it's me Manas Kisip and today I am going to explain you all a paragraph and my paragraph goes like this they like to hunt together keeping in touch whenever they go out of sight behind rocks or bushes by twittering and calling. This line means that whenever mongoose go outside of their shelter, they go in a group and keeping a connection between them with a chirping sound. Another line, always on the lookout for danger, hawks, eagles and large snakes, they warn one another with a special alarm call if they spot anything suspicious. This line means that whenever mongoose feel dangerous like hawks, eagles and large snakes, they alert one another with a specific alarm call if they see anything doubtful. Thank you everyone. So hello everyone, myself Yubraj Kumar from Standard 6 and today I am going to explain English Literature Chapter, Chapter 9, Desserts Animal, Paragraph 6. So let's get started. So Paragraph 6 goes like this. Mongooses are famous for being able to kill snakes without getting hurt themselves. This knife means that mongooses have skill that they can kill snakes 
without even getting hurt from them means uh, mongooses have skills that you can tell ability also and talent that they can kill the snakes without getting hurt themselves their reactions are so fast that they can dodge each time the snake strikes in this line there is a word dodge which means move quickly to avoid the in avoid its enemy so this line tell us that mongooses reactions are very fast that they can quickly avoid the snake sector they are very fast that they can quickly avoid snakes attack they continually make a new signs of themselves until after a while when the snake gets tired they quickly dive in for the kill in this line there is uh, one more word nuisance which means annoyance which you can also say irritating like this now this line says that mongooses continually keep annoying the snakes and uh, attacks until the snakes get not get tired once the snakes get tired the mongooses jumped quickly and kill the snakes the mo- once the snakes got tired the mongooses jumped and kill the snakes so the paragraphs ends here so that's all thank you have a nice day good morning everyone my name is akshil jolan and i am going to recite you a story of chapter 9 the desert animal paragraph 7 All the female mongooses have their kitten at about the same time means all the female mongooses have their babies or kitten at one time they are raised by the whole group in a den made inside an old tarmat mount or hollow log means they have they have take the care of her babies in a group and they live inside a hollow log and termite mount when most of the adults are out looking for food means when most of the adult mongooses go for searching of food one or two male stay behind the stand guard until the other return for the night means one or two mongo one or two male mongoose stay behind the stand guard for the safety of the small baby mongoose and the female mongoose thank you hello everyone my name is rohit kumar and today i am going to explain paragraph 8 so an, another animal which lives in the desert is the camel so there are many animals that live in deserts so one of them is a camel camels were first domesticated by people many thousands of years ago so camels uh, uh, camels were the domestic camels and was that were domesticated by early mans uh, approx thousands of years ago in the wild camels usually live in small groups of up to 30 animals in the forests the camels uh, that are uh, usually live in a group that are of 30 animals camels have long saggy winter coats to keep warm and shorter tighter coats in the summer to keep cool a thirsty camel can drink as much as the 30 gallons of water that's about 500 full glasses in just 10 minutes a camel when it is thirsty can drink uh, 30 gallons of water that's uh, equals of uh, for 500 glasses that can drink uh, 500 glasses in just 10 minutes normally however it gets all the moisture it needs uh, needs from desert plants and can survive up to 10 months without drinking any water uh, so the animals uh, that get all the moisture uh, the nutrients from the desert plants uh, that's why and can survive for 10 months without drinking any water everyone i am sridhi prasad standard 6d today i am going to explain 
चैप्टर नाइन डेजर्ट एनिमल पैराग्राफ नंबर नाइन फ्रॉम आवर इंग्लिश लिटरेचर बुक हनी सकल फर्स्ट आई विल रीड द पैराग्राफ देन आई विल एक्सप्लेन इट देर आर टू काइंड ऑफ कैमल वन नोन एज द डोमेस्ट्री हैज ओनली a single hump the other is called bacterian camel and has two humps the humps helps the animal to survive in the desert by acting as storage containers but they don't store water as many people wrongly believe they are full of fat this fat nourishes the camel when food is scarce if they have no nothing to eat for several days their humps shrinks and as the fat is used up there are many other ways in which camels ca- are adapted to desert life their mouths are so tough that even the sharp thorns cannot pierce through according to the paragraph camel having only single hump is known as domestic camel and the camel having two humps is known as bacterian camel Camel can survive in desert without food for many days. Fat stored in the hump nourishes the camel when they are without food. Camel's mouth are so tough that even thorny leaves or thorny plants doesn't damage it. As we know that camels are also known as ship of the desert. That's all. Thank you. Paragraph one: Is that animal? These are the driest places on the earth, and sometimes go for a month or even a year without rain. It means that these are is the hottest place on the earth, and there is no rain for a year or a month. But even a desert animal cannot survive without water or for a long period of in a scorching sun. It means that desert animal cannot survive without water for a long time in a scorching sun. So they have had to find different way of coping with the condition. So the animals that live in desert have to find different way of live in the harsh condition. For example, garvil spend the hottest part of the day in the cool underground burrows. It means that garvil spend the hottest part of the day in desert in the underground burrows. Burrows underground burrows means the hole that made animal for live. and eastern insects called darkling beetle are expert to catching drops of moisture on their legs and lift them into the drop of the trackling down into the mouth the insect that is called darkling beetle have expert in catch the drop of moisture in their legs and put in the mouth not all desert animal are in the list not all desert animals not